Politol from Politol.com and I uh, will make this is the first video about uh, crossover um, this is a crossover tutorial about um, how to use cross ties um, I'm gonna show this for uh, the specific game uh, uh, Worms Mayhem and I'm gonna show you in this video um, how to uh, get this specific game running on crossover uh, if you go to buy platform games and then you go to uh, Worms Mayhem then um, you can uh, purchase uh, Worms uh, on Amazon um, to get the serial and then you can activate it to the Steam and then if you uh, don't have uh, crossover yet you can uh, sign up uh, here for a uh, 40 day trial you can uh, click on uh, download free trial and then you have to enter your uh, username and email and then you can download uh, the file I have to create an account as well uh, because uh, with the account you can uh, you can log in and then uh, you can use the uh, 14 days you can use uh, the game or you can purchase it of course and then you can have uh, no limits um, now if you uh, downloaded it uh, crossover then uh, uh, and you have no, uh, uh, you know, yeah, I have no no money to to, uh, to buy the game, but you would do want to uh, to use crossover. You can always be uh, an active an advocate while you have to do some um, some testing and some ranking, some games. Um, and for the time being, when you're active, uh, you can use the crossover freely. Um, well, for your personal use, uh, while you are also testing some games, of course, and then you can use it uh, it freely uh, for the time being. Um, then um, I come to the part where you have uh, you can use cross ties. Well, if you downloaded the game of the, of the game, you've downloaded crossover, uh, which will be of course after download in your downloads folder. If you double click it, it will uh, it will say uh, if you want to move it to the programs. So if you click on yes, it will be on programs. And then if you double click it, I'll close it now. If you double click it, it will uh, launch crossover. It will be bouncing here a bit, and then uh, if you're uh, um, not already uh, saving, uh, have saved everything. Then uh, it will first ask for an uh, email address and your uh, password, which you've, of your account, which you created uh, a moment ago for the first time, uh, when uh, signing up on Crossover. And then uh, you were able to use Crossover. Um, about the whole use of Crossover, about all the functions, so we'll make uh, some more videos uh, in the future. For me, it's now important to show um, how cross ties work. Um, I will create cross ties, um, or if it's already uh, already exists, I will link to those um, cross ties. Uh, the whole thing is is just clicking on the app, or clicking on the cross tie, and it will work. So that's the cool thing about it. So in this case, you launched crossover for the first time. If that launch process is ended, you can well. To, uh, run every cross tie so um, I click on this cross tie say use this cross tie to install steam into crossover and start the fun well okay I click on cross tie and hey this link will um, open the tie and it will ask here um, what program to use well the tie is more mainly used for crossover of course so you can click on crossover and you can also click my uh, thing I want to uh, um, save so it will automatically so if we click OK 
you will see it will download in the tie and then it will do everything what's in the tie and in the tie it's uh, set what to do so it will uh, pre-install all, all kind of software what's needed to run the game normally so the only thing you have to do is click install that's the main thing but if you say all right I want to uh, have a specific bottle and that's you can um, compare with a wrapper so if you want to use a different wrapper a different bottle you can um, instead of using every time the same one you can uh, click on this one I want to install into a new Windows XP bottle and you click on um, new Windows XP bottle or if you have an existing one you can click, click on, the, uh, on the ones you have already there uh, but that's for the ones who are already using cross uh, crossover for a while if you're new then uh, you just can click on new Windows XP bottle and then you can name it like if this is uh, Worms Mayhem, I already have one here, you can type here Worms Mayhem, Worms Mayhem, well two in this case. I click on install and here it will say in the install notes what it will do. This is Dutch here because I am Dutch and it's recognized the language here for your, well for you it might be in English or in Spanish or whatever so that's very cool click on install and it will install so what it does now is um, it will pre-install all the, the things mentioned here um, which steam needs so we'll pre-install everything some in some cases you need to click on uh, the next and accept some some um, some OLAS because of these legal issues. Here we have to say also accept. Then Steam itself, of course, very important. English whatever language you want. Click finish. And then you will see if you go to here you see that um, if you go to uh, whoop, go to bottles. You will see here Worms Mayhem 2. You see that's uh, the one I created a moment ago. But I will go more on this topic later, and, thus, and then we'll tell you about the options which uh, Crossover has. It's still updating here. The first time if you were uh, updating Steam, it will take a little bit. It's the same as I show in, in the Wineskin wrappers with Steam. But the first time it's updating, downloading, it will take a, a second or 20. Or a bit later. Or longer. So. So this is a bit like uh, okay here it starts as already show, already mentioned after downloading it will launch and it will show the big steam uh, screen as you remember in Windows then log in and then after logging in you can use the serial which you uh, purchase for in this case amazon.com uh, for Windows Mayhem and copy uh, and copy paste uh, the serial into uh, uh, Steam, and then it will download the game, and then you can play it. I will cancel this one because uh, I clicked on it. Okay, well, um, 
but that's about it and then it will work um, I will show you can okay, show very quickly uh, here steam for pay the heist like this you'll see here Oops. Well, they will log in. And then I can uh, play the game. Like in this game, in this case, I think it is uh, paid at the heist. So then you know this one game works fine as well. Oh, this time it's worms. Pay the heist as well. Hey, pay the heist as well. Play. So, it's very simple. Wow. Well, as already mentioned. So, thank you for watching. Hope to see you back on polls.com. If you love the work I do, you can also donate to my website, become a premium member, and support my hard work. And yeah, uh, spread the word and see you back on polls.com. Bye bye.